the Earth. On our planet Earth, in the past, humanity drew from its environment the primary energy sources and transformed them. We transform these primary energy sources into thermal energy, in wind power, in mechanical energy. In short, humanity produced secondary energy to find a better way of life. It's as simple as that. Today, people continue to draw primary energy sources from their environment, but we now turn them into an absolutely fantastic second energy. Electrical energy. Electrical energy almost immediately can be converted into any secondary energy into mechanical energy, thermal energy, radiant energy. Electricity is used to power radios, televisions, computers. But how did man create this fantastic secondary energy? Because, unfortunately, there are no power mines. So, to generate electricity, we must use sources of primary energies. First of all, we must find water, coal, refined oil, or uranium. But how do we use them? Well, well, the next step will be to turn those primary energy sources into mechanical energy by rotating turbines. These turbines can rotate thanks to hydraulic energy of a waterfall or through the use of wind power. And most of the time, these turbines are activated by steam power. First, we burn primary sources of energy to heat water. Secondly, the water becomes steam. And thirdly, this steam goes through a turbine and makes it turn. That's all? No, no, no. It might sound a bit complicated, but it is actually quite simple. So, the turbines rotate. The turbines rotate at high speeds and they use a rotor, that is to say a magnet, a rotor which rotates within a stator of copper. This unit is used to create a magnetic field which produces an electrical current. Rotor, stator, rotor, stator, rotor, stator. And the birth of electricity. Electricity, first carried by high voltage cables and then transmitted by small cables up to our home. However, the difficulty is that electricity is hard to store. It is like a bicycle. If you stop pedaling, the bike stands still and you fall off. If the turbine stops running, the light bulbs are no longer fueled and they are turned off. So we have to constantly run the turbines to power the electrical appliances. Rotor, stator, rotor, stator, rotor, stator, rotor, stator. Thus humans will endlessly seek primary energy to power the turbine. That is also why people must also think carefully about not wasting this valuable secondary energy that has become so essential. Will we be smart enough to continue to make the best of the world on our beautiful planet Earth? <laughs>